Hello, hello everybody. Welcome to Monday. Monday's Slarpg. The adventure continues. I hope y'all had a great weekend. Um, mine was a bit weird, but I am excited to dive back into this. Or we begin Act Three. Man, I've already played seven hours. Uh, time, time flies when you're, uh, smooching your girlfriend, I guess. <laughs> um, uh, but before I jump into it, I do want to mention, um, I've been made aware there's a, a friend and inspiration had, um, some medical, uh, medical bit, so had, had to do some emergency medical and, um, got soft with some tax stuff. So, uh, I would implore you if you've not checked out um Oyasumi Yuni, um give her a gander. Um she's doing a doodle a thon this week leading up to her birthday, which is actually at the end of this week. So that's isn't that always the best time for um rough financial waters and having to worry about stuff is right before you get to celebrate something. Yay. Um but give her give her some love and support, and if if you can spare some some funny money, um, she she's uh, she's doing little adorable little doodle doodle scrunglios. Um, let's see if I put in the command right. It was uh, doodle fawn. Yes, 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 yes. Um, and as as a little incentive. Um, I, I've, I've kind of been, I've kind of been bouncing around something like this for a while, but if you throw in, give me, send, send me like a receipt of what you, what you sent in and, uh, give me three colors and an object. Um, there, there's a, a program that lets me do like oil paintings that I've been fiddling with and I will do, I'll do kind of a, kind of a 500 by 500 pixel, kind of a quick, I say quick, 30 minutes is, doesn't feel like it's quick. Um, kind of what what comes to mind when you give me the colors in that object? Um, it's kind of kind of scab esque. It's just sort of like you give me stuff, and I'll, I'll I'll give you what what comes out. I did like a I did a really quick one, um, really quick example because uh, I didn't hear about the the emergency and the plans until uh, late this afternoon. So I've kind of been scrambling to try and find something I can do to help out. I'm a, I'm not an amazing cracked artist like um she is or some of the other people helping out, but um you know, if uh if you're uh if you wanna help out any any little bit. And you know, society together strong. <laughs> um oh shit, I just realized that doesn't link uh, where the donation things is. Ooh, that's, hmm, let me, let me fix that real quick. Uh, I'll, I'll just add that to the, the text. And then I'll, I'll probably just delete and rerun. So I can, I can, I can fucking pin it or something. Or actually, let me just make a message and pin it. Uh, sorry about this. Instead of, for the one time I have all my pr prepared stuff ready, uh, right out the gate, uh, uh, something else has got me scrambling a little bit. Let me put. So I know the the incentives they have for the little doodles. They're only doing while they are live. Um, some of the people in their circle are also sort of contributing. So like Semi Spree is doing something similar, and I believe uh, uh, KT, the uh, the other person of the Siak crew, might be doing something similar. Um, I'll, I'll I'll probably modify this as I learn more, but just for just for FYSA, like. If you want to get a doodle, you kind of have to drop in while they are alive to throw your doodle. Um, just, just so you don't, 
just to make sure you're aware. Um, and the best part is, the best part is though, is the final, all the doodles are going to be put together in a poster and it will be available, um, as sort of like a, a, a birthday, uh, poster kind of thing that you can, that you can get. So it will be immortalized, your little shenanigans. Hey, Glottal. I was kind of doing a, doing a, doing a little bit for, for Uni's doodle upon trying to craft this message to pin real quick. Uh, We'll just pin that to the end of the stream. All right. All right. <clears throat> um, that should be it for uh, all the stuff before we begin. So let's actually get into the swing of Slarpg. I see we are up to 66 kisses. We are almost up to funny number of kisses. Um, hydrate? All right. All right. All right. Probably, probably definitely gonna need end a stretch. Okay. <sighs> yeah, you gotta, you gotta make sure you stretch. You know, you don't wanna, you don't wanna pull your sword arm, um, right before you're fighting interdimensional invaders. Okay, so I, the beeline for that save point last night. Hey, I thought you worked in the Amber Woods. What are you doing on the here on the beach? I've got multiple part-time jobs. What can I say? My talents are needed in many places. Okay, yeah, great. More importantly, how are things in green? Everyone okay? Huh? Oh, sure, I guess. I've been here all day, though. Why? Is there something I should be worried about back in town? Uh, yeah? Might be a good call to stay out here for now, dude. Well, regardless. Care to buy anything? This location sucks, so y'all are my first customers all week. It's true, always warm up before a fight. Even if you're fighting, just level one slime. You know, those those slimes are deceptive. They're very elastic. Um, it can be it can be pretty hard to really put them down. Why is this tropical shirt such good armor? Uh, sure. Um, how is our potions? I think we're good on potions. Ooh, map. Always buy maps. Thanks for the business! Alright, we need to equip. A tropical shirt is better than a chainmail vest. Damn. I wonder if it's because, like, it is so blinding that the enemy... It, it's more its more of a dodge defense than, like, functional defense, if that makes sense. <laughs> oh. Hmm. See, three defense at the cost of ten magic defense. Actually? I think I think we'll leave Jody with her breastplate. That's actually pretty good. All right, we'll save again because we had to change. Sometimes being relaxed is the best defense. Yeah, that's kind of like uh, what is it? The uh, yay old uh, drunken master style. How it's always uh, talked up is the idea is you kind of are flowing with attacks and moving with them and absorbing them. Um, diverting the energy. Crustaceous Conjurer, Toxic Eminem Enemy. Aha! I knew those hats meant they would become mages! Alright, buff Allison. 
Ooh. Um... Well, let's steal from the mage. He might have something funny. And... We will freeze the anemone. And we'll just attack the anemone. Infatuate. Drizzle. Oh no, we're damped! We just got dry. Hell yeah. Alright, we just we'll just fucking full we'll punt the crab. We will actually let me just attack this. Let me preserve my MP. Allison has all the buffs now. Oh, shit. Actually dodged one. Can, can all it do is make us damp? Well, I'm glad it didn't hit us with lightning. I feel like being damp meant lightning would do a lot more damage. Um, is there a way to kind of speed up battles? What the f- <laughs> Just now checking this. <laughs> oh my god. Determines whether or not the game is considered art. How much of the game is politics? Sure. Ludo narrative dissonance. Um, I always forget what Ludo narrative dissonance is. I believe it's the friction between the gameplay elements and the story? I don't know. Do the mechanics fit the story? Okay, okay, okay. So the question is, is is, is 100 mean they're like 1 to 1? Or is it like 0 is 1? You know what, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna leave it as max. You can't go wrong with it being max. No, I don't want to exit. Um... I was kind of hoping to find something to speed up, like, spells. It's like, I don't mind seeing the, the special effects the first time, but in a game where I'm constantly having fights, eventually it can get a little bit time-consuming. Interesting choices. I'm excited to see how this build plays out. <laughs> Don't think you can speed things up. Yeah. I mean, it's not... I've certainly played much more egregious games than this. It's just sort of uh, one of those things that kind of adds up after a while. It's one of the reasons that, like... I've never really thought about going back to Pokemon games again. Um, I say that as if... I'm not, like, raring to sink my teeth into uh, Mega Man Battle Network. Um, and to that I say, you're right, but I, 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 I like the games enough that it, it, it gets past the tedium. Devs are working on a new patch that includes hard mode. Three monster den. Okay. I do like these little monster dens. I think that's a very good idea on this kind of game. It's literally a specific area if you need to grind things out, rather than like a normal JRPG, where like in this game I would have to kill the enemies, rezone to respawn them, then walk all out like... 
it definitely seems like they are aware of the potential for tedium in these kinds of games and have built systems to mitigate them to a reasonable extent. And I, I, I do, I see it, I notice it, I definitely appreciate it. Um, I'm actually going to not kill it this round, because I want Melody to give everyone MC real quick. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely always a fan of... What? I thought I gave MP to everyone. Oh, it's the magic aura. Um, I'll just Paladin's Gift Claire then. I will just beat the shit out of it. Did any Yeah, I'm not I'm not planning on really using them myself. I'm just kind of bullheadedly bashing through it and just trusting my game sense. Cause like it's I'm definitely not getting the vibe it's a brutal souls like tier, like you got a min max kind of thing. And I feel like I can just kind of lean on my general gaming skills and I'll be fine. Because I don't want to make it too easy. I like having a challenge. Ah, oh, this is... A, oh, the warps go to... Interesting. Appears the game is balanced enough that grinding isn't needed. Mechanics are tight. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've definitely felt that. Because, like, last... Um, last week, when we had those boss fights, like, ah, I'm a, I'm a horrible, horrible, uh item hoarder, never using things, but the the boss fight, the way it was laid out, the fact it had consistent ads um, that were like... I, I took a few rounds where I kind of ignored them to do some big damage on the boss, but then I had to scramble to catch up and manage all the status effects that the enemies were dropping on me. And... Oh, always got a buff Allison, she's my main damage. And, you know, it, it, I had to use some items um, to recover. Wait, shit, we gotta, we gotta kill the medic first. Duh. Actually, yeah. So it's, uh... It was a very satisfying, difficult boss fight. I was very happy with it. Even if it looked a little bit risky there for a minute. Uh, we hold it through. Um, actually, let us heal... Actually, hold on, is my... Yeah, no, let's heal. So let's heal Claire. Do some stabbies. Music art right Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It is a... Especially for... Uh, I, I don't know. Indie always feels weird. Um, I like to call them passion projects. Um, when it's a small, like a small individual person. Like maybe a little Kickstarter. Or maybe, you know... Usually they take a lot of time to be made, but you can just... Oh. Come on, we're almost there. Green Ridge is directly north. You can just feel the love and care they put into this game at every level. And I am here to experience everything. Um. Uh, hmm. No. 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 Oh my God! We're too late. No, there has to be something we can do. This must be an illusion or something. Claire. Oh. Oh no. Beaverly. Where's Beaverly? Is she okay? Is she? Oh, shit! 
Boy, are we glad to see you. Right back at you, buddy. You guys hurt? Let me patch you up. Is this the kind of things you guys have been dealing with? This whole neighborhood's a madhouse right now. Hey, where's Beaverly? Have you seen her? Is she somewhere safe? We spent the last hour evacuating as many civilians as we can, but we haven't seen Beaverly. She's probably still in there. What about Faith? Why isn't she with you? Faith's trying to hold down the tower. Whatever these guys want seems to be their main target. Hey, that's not now's not the time to panic. Faith can handle herself. I'm sure Beaverly's fine too. Come on, we're the Paladin Brigade, the sworn protectors of everyone in Green Ridge. We're not gonna let some bozos like this hurt anyone. Neither are you. Now we're setting up an evacuation camp on the coast. We could really use your help getting folks to safety. Hold on. We can find Jabba's scrambler and destroy it. Everything should go back to normal. We need to cut to the chase and do that. No, there's no telling how long it could take to find. People stuck in people. The people stuck in there don't have time to spare. Here, take these warp stones. Use these to warp any civilians you find to safety at the evac camp. You guys totally got this, okay? We'll be in touch. You wanted to be adventurers? Now's your chance to prove yourselves. Come on, we've got work to do. Paladin Brigade, move out! Oh boy, and now the music's distorted. Now, I can't remember the song for Green Ridge itself. I wonder if it's a glitch remix of it though. I feel like that would be topical and something that might be done. The door's all janked up and we can't get in. Hello? Is anyone in there? I guess no one's home? Let's try looking for buildings with intact doors. Glitch Ridge? Nice. God, this this glitch mix is a bop. Tape Trooper, Dark Horse. Oh no, not Dark Horse. It's the relate. Might be related to Bad Horse. Bad Horse. Bad Horse. <laughs> oh man, it has been a very long time since I thought about that. Scorch him. Interesting. Seems like Scorch didn't do much, so let's do multi-freeze just to see if they are weak to it. Ow. Ow. Alright, no particular weakness to Frost. Noted, noted, noted. Uh, let's go for let's go for a high kick because this horse is weird. All right, it has two hooves and wings, um, so it's a it's a bi bipedal horse. I don't I, I don't know. That is very weird. You know, uh, uh, wyverns are characterized by having back legs and then wings. So, this is almost like an equine wyvern. Hey, Kaya Moss! Welcome on by! Doodle Connor! Hey, yeah! It's the Lesbabs game! <laughs> I hope y'all are having a great Monday. I hope y'all had a great weekend. I think, I don't know if it was today or some other day, I think I, I think you were working on a commission, Connor? I've been, uh, you end up managing to get that done, any fun art. 
I wish I wish I could uh, spin off parallel processes to follow everyone I follow. <laughs> it's uh, you know, sometimes sometimes I will put on like four streams and go into a sensory overload coma. Um, but it's not like I can really uh, hang out <laughs> when I do that. <laughs> ah, additions. I always feel so bad when I'm commissioning because I don't, I don't have a good brain. Also, hey, no problem. Thanks for the lurch, Lottle. Thanks for stopping on by. Stream hop instead of multi tap for your health. Yeah, I, I usually open them like. I mostly focus on trying to open them up just to, like, with the idea that, you know, a, um, being a viewer, like, metrics-wise, as far as Twitch's counting, might help. So I usually only have, like, one unmuted at a time, but I might have, like, 12 tabs open. Although that does kill my internet, um... I usually have to manually set them all to, like, 180p, so I can still do anything on my computer. <laughs> um... Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know, there's just so many amazing people, um, and I've been- that- that list of amazing people is just growing longer and longer, and there's only... So many hours I can I can uh, 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 hang out and vibe with people. I'm loving how all these houses are glitched differently and very creatively. Like it would have been really easy for them to just have you know oh we kind of shuffled up the placement of the pixel of the square like we broke up the houses into squares and then we kind of shuffled the squares around. That that would be the easy way. You know, it would have been perfectly fine, but they went the extra mile, and now we have, you know, ones where there's a bunch of duplicated stuff. One that was just a whole bunch of static. Um, that's pretty sweet. Alright, Dark Horses, y'all need to cut that shit out. Um, we'll lovely Aura, and we will. Let's see if Low Kick does more damage. Ooh, Low Kick does do more damage. Hell yeah! Like, what is this house is like all all corners, and then this one is like just static. <laughs> Absolutely nuts. Horse got more weight to drop. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's true. Uh, see, it's like I I do feel it's a little bit weird because usually like between high kick and low kick, I feel like they're equally valid most of the time. Like. When I try to guess what is more effective versus something, um, I don't know. I'm, I, I did, like, three sessions of, like, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. I don't know, like, actual physical combat fighting, so, like, <laughs> the distinction between a high kick and a low kick is lost on me. <laughs> Tape Trooper. Okay. Okay, library is good. Uh, hmm. Did I really blew it up this time, huh, Claire? Oh, screw you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's be nice to the people we're saving, okay? It's a high-stress situation for all of us. What makes you think this is all my fault, huh? Jeez. Maybe the fact that every past 30 since you moved here has been your fault? Ah, well. At least I got a chance to see some monsters up close. Yeah, 
Well, show's over. Shwoom. Was the chair supposed to work with her? It's fine. Don't worry about it. Um... I hope we don't have, like, a teleportation accident. Where, like, she arrives at the destination spot, but, like, halfway inside uh, the chair. Just a little bit of splicing. Recursive looter s loot scooter. Ominous pulp. Oh, the enemy design in this game. Fantastic. You love to see it. Um, we will speed up Allison. And then we will attack the loot scooter. Gotta go fast! Chair mouse fly style? Yeah, 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 exactly. Hmm. Let's do a general heal. Actually, I kind of want to restore MP to everyone. So I kind of need to. I need to sandbag this a little bit. Just renew Allison's buff. Let's give Allison an attack buff, and we'll have Jody just attack. All right, that'll give us four star power, which is enough for the magic aura. And the enemy should be low enough we can one turn it this round. Scorch it. Give it another attack, and I think that should be it. Ah! Wing wheel? Oh, it's like a... It's kind of like a pinwheel. But all... Ooh. It's all feathery. Hmm. Huh. That's... that's really cool. You're cool, Wind Wheel. Unfortunately, you have decided to be my enemy, and therefore, you must die. We will stab it, we will burn it, and we will stab it again. Actually, Allison has a hammer, so it's not really a stab, it's more of a crunch. Yeah, I figured, I figured, uh, fire would be the weakness of it. It looked very plant-like, uh, so we burned. Burn, burn, burn. Burning wheel of fire going. Round, 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 as the flames keep getting higher. And just molt frost. I should take care of both. And then full corp. Oh, actually, I should have done healing. You know what? I will just heal outside of combat. Even though I often forget to do so. Hmm. Yeah, this doesn't look right. Alright, we heal right. Alright, we'll go around this away. Whee! Oh no, the kid's shop! Nope, Terran Space Time. Well, you know what we gotta do. Anytime we have a Terran Space Time, we gotta yoink it. Hell yeah, 36 gold. Ah shit, Claire's been corrupted. Alright, let's purify her real quick. And 
Let's steal from the loot scooter? Let's see what it has. See if that gives us anything. 125 gold. To be fair, the loot scooter looks to be made of, like, pure gold. So we probably just kind of... We probably just kind of take one of the snails out. Sun Sudan. Hmm. Cra That's not cradle snatching. They're not babies. They're just recursive. They're like a fractal snail. Like, the more you zoom in on the snail, the more snails there are. They just snail forever. Don't go to me or my son or my son or my son. <laughs> Exactly! It's like me or my son or my son or my son or my daughter or my son or my daughter or my daughter or my son or my daughter or my son. You know, that'd be a really rough family to uh to to date one of the children. Cause, you know, they they bring they bring you over to introduce you to their family and just it takes the introductions just take a take all day. Um they kinda go on forever. <laughs> All right, everyone just slap them. There we go. All right, let's see the kids. Uh, hmm. What are you kids still doing here? We're under attack. It's times like these when people need adventuring gear the most. Yeah, we gotta arm everyone. We gotta help fight back. I admire your spirit, but have you looked outside lately? Your new location isn't exactly getting gonna get much traffic. Yeah, leave this to the adults, guys. Hey, you ever two wanted to teleport? Boy, have I! Every single day of my life, yes. Well then, here's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Shroom. Hmm. Oh, that's... new. Howdy, y'all lie poison. What? This is a simple question, miss. No, we don't like poison. Why would anybody like poison? Well, that's too bad, because I got you some. Made some poison burst in some Odea Dunderlands. You'll probably run into them later. Should... Should we say thank you? Is... Is that what you're expecting here? We don't have time for this. Bo bold, bold move, Cotton? Question mark? Um, alright, we need to get up there, perhaps? What's our, what's our quest say? Alright, we need Beaverly at Higgledy Piggledy's. We need Leon family from the magic. Okay, so we do need to get up. It's just the question of how do we get up? Hmm. Hmm. Actually, let's save real quick and see. Nope, you're into the library. Did I miss a path going up here? I don't think so. We get some smooches, we get some stabbings, we give some burnings, we give some attacks. You know, actually, I think I want to switch Tinker off Jody. I think I want to give her beast style because she kind of is lacking some offense. And for like these these chumps, we're just we're just burning them. We're just burning them down. So more damage is better. And like 
I would like to use Tinker, but it's using a consumable. So I kind of want to save it for boss fights. Oh no, you stole mana from my fighter? Bold move. Uh, let's see how that turns out. Nice work, team. Yep, it leads me back here. Um, let's do a quick bit of healing on Jody. How will you cast Punch now? I cast this! Yeah, those muscle wizards are uh, pretty strong. Actually, that makes me think of an old uh, story of a. Uh, I don't. I think it was like the old like D and D three point five era sort of stuff. But um, a party was fighting like some mind flayers or something, and the barbarian like got the top of their head sliced open off of some like failure or whatnot. And the DM was like, "Well, you're about to die. I'll let you do one last action." And so the barbarian was like. Um, I rip out my brain from my cranium and throw it at the Mind Flayer. And the DM was like, uh, okay, roll, you know, usual roll to hit, roll for damage. And it, like, cr it basically crit and, like, insta-give the Mind Flayer. <laughs> and then this parting, parting quiff was like, well, I guess barbarians are the real masters of the mind. What am I missing? Do I need to go back to go forward? Is it one of those situations? <coughs> How dare you yeet me into the void. Oh, this is the camp. I see. Or something over here? Actually, does this locked door open? Nope, still doesn't open. Hmm. What am I missing in town? Because we need to get to north side. But I'm failing to do so. I'm so bad. <laughs> All right, I'll stretch and hydrate. <laughs> oh yes! Wiggle them fingers. Stretch those arms. Ah. Ah. All right. I certainly, certainly am feeling, feeling the glitch today. Kind of mess up my sleep schedule this weekend because I was, I have been bouncing between a lot of projects. I've been making a lot of progress, but uh, I kind of was too excited to work on some things and kept losing track of time. So like I uh, today, I went to bed at like six o'clock. <laughs> Not the best time. <laughs> hey, Grandma's regret. Welcome on by. I hope that you're having a good Monday. I hope you had a great weekend. All right, what am I fucking missing? Alright, we already talked to him. Go away, Clinston. Is there something over here? Is there like, do I phase through things? I'm missing something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Hmm. Huh. What do we have over here? Ah, hello! Welcome to my new art studio! I'm working on a statue of our leader. Wow, this Queen Varenna is a lot more rectangular than I thought she would be. It just started, asshole. Yeah, that's very insensitive. Core Guardian Model 2S. Alright. A little overcompensating with two swords. Oh, uh, it's kind of... Kind of weird, but okay. We'll, uh... We'll work with that. Saber tooth jump. Ow, that's some hella damage. Medic. Attack boost Allison, and then we'll just do another normal attack. Oof. Oof. Do a lovely aura, and let's go for a. Is it burning? I think it is burning. I think this should kill it. Yeah, there we go. Book him up. Wing wheel? Alright, that's no problem. Single enemy? Very simple. And we'll just do a normal... another normal round. I do need to take a minute and heal after combat, though. That would be awkward if I started dying on... Schmuck. Well, that's going to be embarrassing. Holy crap. I stand corrected. Okay. 2,000 gold in the couch cushions. Noted. Um, let's save. What is this little thundercloud? Uh, I guess it's just an obstacle. It's this guy. Big beat. Oh, how I love good old fashioned havoc. Oh, hello. We then look at our new beachfront property options. You, you want to Jarvis's boys. What do you think you're doing in our town? Ah, yes, I remember you now. Apologies. I'm just keeping an eye on the troops. Father has ordered me not to fight you for the time being. I need to reserve my strength for high level foes. I'm sorry. That doesn't describe you. Enjoy all the monster attacks and death traps, though. How considerate. Fucking the derpy little face on the medic slimes always <laughs> fucking gets me. It's so scrungly. <laughs> uh. Now I'll heal. And we'll do multi scorch. You're really awkward if it heals before the scorch and then survives. Just finish him off. Good shit. Alright, 
I need to give some mana to Claire. Allison can finish that off. Actually, we'll just do another round of normal attacks. That should be good. Yeah, there we go. Do need to heal. Because Claire likes to die. Because she doesn't invest in HP. Oh, the other thing punks like they are. This terror is my territory. Mom, can I have permission to do one of my special attacks without getting grounded? Oh, sure, sure. Let her rip, pet. <laughs> Damn, Pepper. Fuck them up. I think I think they're fine. <laughs> I don't think there's supposed to be grass inside the house. Um, I will admit I'm not a homeowner, but I think the lawn is intended to be outside. Um, I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong. No, no I like it that way. Either. <laughs> well, okay. Then. I mean, honestly, if it's like fresh grass, like. You know, some nice healthy grass just feels nice to walk through. I wouldn't mind having it. I feel like it would be really hard to keep maintained though, because like instead of instead of like mopping your floor, you'll have to like run a lawnmower through it. That could be a little annoying. Not gonna lie. Multi Scorch, thank you very much. I want to Paladin's Gift yourself, and then we burn, burn, burn! The flames keep getting higher! Damn, Core Guardian 2's got some HP. Keep her topped off. Uh, let's go with Fan the Flames and. Uh, let's get an attack boost. I feel like that'll be more useful than burning another spell. Oh, that did not do as much damage as I thought it was gonna do. Damn. Um, what about a high kick? And let's try Frost. Maybe it's weak to Frost. Oh shit! Okay, never mind. High kick is high kick is the solution to uh, the Core Guardian problem. Damn. Oh, they stole all the refrigerators. Hmm. Oh. Hey, Durangar! Glitchcraft? Ooh, interesting. This is, uh, huh. Wow, this one's seen better days. I don't know if we should keep even touch this thing. I mean, hey, this one might be weird, but that's half the fun of magic. Now we're gonna look at Gift Spellbook in the mouth. It has a mouth? <laughs> yeah, that would be concerning. But, uh, hope you're, uh, hope you're having a good, having a good day, Durangar. Or at least, a fantastic start to your evening. What is in witchcraft? Jolt, lovely aura, mystery beam, and beam banana. Oh, I read that as beam banana. Hmm. I feel like it'd be dangerous to use such an experimental book. Well, let's check the fireplace. Nope, nothing in the fireplace. Beginning of the weekend and you made a mistake? Oh no! What did you do, Durangar? You fool! Drink an energy drink at 17- Yep, 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 that'll do it. 
especially if you don't have all, an already super high uh, energy energy drink tolerance. And that will uh, that will do it. All right, let's push this damn block out of the way. Sure, great. Yeah, uh, I ah, oh, it's a monster den. No, no, I don't want to deal with that. I don't need a monster den. Well, at least my place is okay somehow. Make yourselves at home if we want to recharge real quick. Should we all take five minute power nap to keep from crashing? Hell yeah. Yeah, I kind of fucked my sleep schedule this weekend as well. I uh, I went to bed at like 6am today. <laughs> Oops.